Get ready for the total eclipse in Burlington, Vermont on April 8th, 2024. As you can see in the total eclipse guide, I've got uh, the Vermont total eclipse guide that I wrote. You can see that Burlington is well within the total eclipse path. The yellow line is the total eclipse path, and then the blue line is the center line. Burlington will experience a totality of 3 minutes and 15 seconds. For a northern state, it's doing very well. The eclipse starts at 2.14 in the afternoon, and then the totality begins at 3.26 and 05 seconds. And then the totality ends at 3.29 and 20 seconds. And then finally, the eclipse finishes at 4.37 in the afternoon. Now, one thing that you need to note is you're going to want to get a set of solar eclipse glasses. Solar eclipse glasses, you put them on and you will protect your eyes from the sun. Don't think you're going to use welding goggles or mylar film or anything else. You need to get proper solar eclipse glasses to protect your very important eyeballs. People in 2017 bought some cheapies off Amazon and they hurt their eyes. The link below I have is to certified American Astronomy Association glasses and then even better yet, buy them from your local store so you know they're properly designed and made for you. When the moon first begins blocking the sun, you need to put your solar eclipse glasses on so you can experience the joy of seeing the partial eclipse. But when the moon completely blocks the sun, the diamond of the sun winks out, you can pull your solar eclipse glasses off, look in the sky and experience the corona of the sun and the stars in the sky in the middle of the day. It's totally unreal. The crickets might even start chirping. And then when the moon moves a little ways away from the sun, the diamond sparkle happens. You put these on, you're like, oh my gosh and you're super excited, you make sure to put your glasses back on and finish watching the solar eclipse. It's going to be a spectacular experience. Now, in my Vermont eclipse guide, I'm going to show you the path over Vermont of where the eclipse is going to happen. It's going to pass over the upper third of the state and it's definitely remote. I mean, that's for sure. It's definitely not in the lower part of the US, but People in northern Vermont will get a chance to experience a total eclipse. And this is simply how the total eclipse happens. The sun, 93 million miles away, hits the moon and the moon creates a shadow on the earth. The really dark part is the total eclipse. And then the outer is the partial eclipse. Even though the partial eclipse is pretty interesting, the totality is a whole different experience that you want to enjoy. So definitely be prepared. Check out my book, The Vermont Total Eclipse Guide, in ebook and paperback. And most importantly, make sure to get your solar eclipse glasses to protect your eyeballs in Vermont, Burlington, on April 8th, 2024. Good luck eclipse chasing!